a broker should ensure that their advertising is accurate, supported by evidence and balanced, that brokers should get good legal and compliance advice before they publish um, an advertisement, and that ASIC has a strategic priority of informed um, consumers and we actively monitor this area and take action where necessary. Advertising plays a crucial role in consumers' decisions about financial products and that is why advertising is a focus for the Commission uh, at the moment. The first important thing to say is that when claims are made in advertising, it's important that those claims are accurate and that they are supported by evidence. For example, if you make a claim in an advertisement that a product is free, then that product can't have any hidden costs or transaction fees or anything like that. Um, otherwise, there you'll be in danger of being misleading. Um, brokers also need to take particular care um, when making a claim about consumers getting projected savings where those savings are not yet evident. It is also important that an advertisement contains balanced information to ensure that the ad gives an overall impression um, that is realistic about the product or the service. Uh, for example, um, an, a particular product may be cheap, but it also may have strict limitations or extra costs, and all of that needs to be reflected in an advertisement. The obligations around advertising are important legal obligations, so my best advice to brokers is that they get robust legal and compliance advice before they publish an advertisement. Um, we've issued the guidance that I talked about earlier, and that contains examples, real examples, from the credit industry where brokers and credit providers have tripped up um, with misleading advertising. So if brokers and their advisors read our guidance, they may be able to learn from the mistakes of others.